Afghan officials said on Thursday that government troops pushed into Kunduz overnight and forced the Taliban out. The international coalition in Afghanistan backing the government had no immediate comment on the situation. But despite prompt claims from officials that much of the city had been liberated, by midday Thursday, residents remaining inside Kunduz said they could still hear explosions and shooting outside. That's according to Associated Press. Around 500 Afghan army elite special ops troops advanced on the city from the government-held airport on Wednesday night. By around 7 o'clock local time, officials say Kunduz was back in the government's hands. Taliban militants captured the city in northern Afghanistan on Monday. According to AP, they gained access during the recent Muslim holiday Eid, when many Afghans travel in and out of urban areas. It was the first time the insurgents had seized a major city since the 2001 US-led invasion. But on Thursday morning, residents said that major government buildings were once again under government control. They also said that the roads were strewn with the bodies of dead Taliban fighters. According to officials, Afghan troops will now advance beyond the city to fight the Taliban in other areas of Kunduz province where they've taken territory.